Ever wondered which Volkswagens are worth your hard-earned cash and which ones could drain your wallet? With so many models and choices, it's easy to get confused. Today, we're diving deep into the world of Volkswagen to highlight the top picks you should consider and the ones you should avoid. Stick around to find out which cars will give you the best bang for your buck and which ones to steer clear of. First, let's take a look at the top Volkswagen cars to buy. Number one, 2008 to 2012 Volkswagen Golf. When it comes to small cars, the 2008 to 2012 Volkswagen Golf is a standout. Known for its reliability, stylish design, and excellent fuel efficiency, this car is a great choice for daily commutes or weekend adventures. The Golf's four-door layout provides practical space, making it ideal for families or anyone needing extra room. With a proven track record for durability and minimal major issues, it's a reliable and practical option. Number 2. 2005 to 2009 Volkswagen Jetta Sportwagen. If you're in the market for a mid-size vehicle with added utility, the 2005 to 2009 Volkswagen Jetta Sportwagon is worth considering. This model stands out for its high practicality and impressive fuel economy, especially in the diesel version. The TDI engine from these years is known for its longevity and efficiency, achieving up to 55 miles per gallon in some cases. It's also a fun car to drive, with a lot of potential for performance tuning. Number 3. 2006 to 2012 Volkswagen Phaeton. For those looking for a luxurious ride without breaking the bank, the 2006 to 2012 Volkswagen Phaeton is an excellent choice. Despite being a high-end model, you can find them at surprisingly affordable prices due to their niche status. The Phaeton offers luxury features similar to a Bentley Continental, including top-notch leather and advanced technology. While repair costs might be higher, the value you get for the price is substantial. Number 4. 2007 to 2017 Volkswagen Tigon. In the SUV category, the 2007 to 2017 Volkswagen Tigon with the 2.0 TSI four-cylinder engine is a standout. This engine is known for its good fuel economy and ease of maintenance. It's also a practical choice for families, offering ample space and a comfortable ride. Its design and performance make it a solid option in the crowded SUV market. Number 5. 2003 to 2008 Volkswagen GTI. For a sporty option, the 2003 to 2008 Volkswagen GTI is a top pick. It features a powerful 2.0 turbo TSI motor, delivering an exciting driving experience. The GTI combines sporty handling with practicality, making it a fun and functional choice for driving enthusiasts. It's well regarded for its performance and relative ease of maintenance. Now let's take a look at the Volkswagen cars you should avoid. Number 1. 2008 to 2012 Volkswagen Golf TDI. While the regular Golf is a great buy, the 2008 to 2012 Golf TDI, with its diesel engine, is best avoided. The newer TDI models come with complex emission systems like the AdBlue and diesel particulate filter, which can lead to frequent and costly repairs. Problems with these systems can severely impact performance and lead to high repair costs that outweigh the benefits of the diesel engine's fuel efficiency. Number 2. 2006 to 2011 Volkswagen Jetta TDI. Similarly, the 2006 to 2011 Volkswagen Jetta TDI falls into the not to buy category. The stringent emission controls on these diesel models result in a host of potential issues and expensive repairs. The costs associated with maintaining these systems can quickly erode any savings from the fuel economy. Number 3. 2002 to 2007 Volkswagen Touareg TDI 510. In the large SUV category, the 2002 to 2007 Volkswagen Touareg TDI 510 should be avoided. This model's complex engine design makes it notoriously difficult and expensive to repair. The lack of space around the engine adds to the difficulty, leading to high labor costs if you need professional repairs. It's better to avoid this model unless you're prepared for potential maintenance headaches. Number 4. Older Volkswagen Sporty Models Older sporty Volkswagen models, including the early GTIs, Siroccos, and Rabbits, 
are best avoided due to their outdated technology and complex systems. These cars often come with hard-to-find parts and costly repairs, which can quickly add up. The difficulty in maintaining these older models can outweigh the enjoyment of owning a classic Volkswagen. Thanks for tuning in to our Volkswagen guide. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more Buy This Not That content. Got any questions or suggestions? Drop them in the comments below and we might cover them in our next video. See you next time.